Let's go shopping guys! We are going to the Outlet Village in Dubai for some retail therapy and R&R. So stay tuned and chill. Our drive to the Outlet Village will take an estimate of an hour. It is a beautiful sunny day today, clear blue skies, the traffic is pretty mild and the drive very comfortable and as we are about to arrive we have now reached our destination and to my left is the Rove Hotel where we will be staying the night and to my right is the Outlet Village shopping mall yes it is only a stone throw away upon arriving here is the lobby of the Rove Hotel it is bright it is welcoming and the staff are very friendly so we've just collected our keys and we're heading up to our room that we will be staying for the night so here it is it is a simple room very clean and tidy and it has all the required amenities like soaps and shampoo and also a very comfortable bed to sleep in right and yes uh, we are going up and away to a weekend of r and r and shopping and here is the beautiful view of the poolside it is stunning and i am happy Heading on to the following afternoon, yes, we did sleep right through breakfast and lunch and it is now approaching 3 p.m. We are looking for a park and once we found our parking, I am heading into the mall and yes, you can see, super excited for some retail therapy and great bargains to boot. <laughs> So heading in, you can see rows of shops and boutiques and that's to my right and as we walk towards the left of the mall, we see the diver where we'll be having a scrumptious tea come lunch. Yep, I am looking forward to having some pancakes and crepes and a nice cup for the day. Here is our wonderful meal. Yes, it was delicious and I am contented. So now that we have eaten and we are full, we are ready to shop till we drop, right? <laughs> so as we walk through the stores, we have come to one of my favorite stores, the Etoile Outlet. They have beautiful, colorful garments and dresses and I was looking towards the ethro fashion wear and the beautiful paisley designs but unfortunately nothing spoke to me or called out to me but yet I was a very happy girl. So off we went to the next door. A few steps away is Carolina Herrera. Again, another pretty store full of beautiful colors. Here is an array of shoes and small leather goods, bags and fashion wear. However, I was in and out within 10 minutes as I couldn't find anything that I liked. So we went to Agna. I really like their logo and yeah, it was um, a nice shopping experience. I did buy a belt and I was very happy with my purchase. However, I did see this beautiful leather embroidered jacket. Um, unfortunately, you know, I thought once, I thought twice, but I left the store without it as I have too many black leather jackets. The next favorite store would be The Deal. It's one of the biggest stores there. They have a huge variety of branded goods from Max Mara, Ferragamo, Valentino, Ralph Lauren, so many different um, designers. And I did see the 
this beautiful denim dress from D squared. Unfortunately, it was a size too big, so off I went to the next rack of denim jeans. I do love my jeans, and I spotted this beautiful tiger embroidered jean, but it was way too big. So I headed towards the accessories and sunglasses. I was able to find a pretty pair of sunglasses and I did leave the store with that purchase. And I was super stoked that it was Mother's Day sale and I got an extra 20% off on top of the already marked down The end of the evening we came home with quite a few bags and i will definitely film a try and haul video on my next one we finally come to the end of our shopping spree today little did we know we spent over five hours at this factory outlet mall in dubai and it was fun and we got lots of good buys and we're off, driving off home right now back to Abu Dhabi so cheers to everyone so do comment down below if you'd like to see more videos of uh, my shopping sprees um, and yeah I'll definitely get back to you on that um, do subscribe to my channel leave me a thumbs up Till the next video, good night everyone.